Welcome back to my channel How are you guys? I hope you are well and stay happy And don't forget to stay safe and also healthy during the pandemic So at the moment I want to presentation and tell you about food and also beverage But before I do that I would like to introduce myself first My name is Mimade Mitsushi Jayanti I'm person number 16 from 4C Tourism Business Management Alright, let me start my presentation As we know, food and beverage are special things or meat that we need every day Now, I would like to explain about food and also beverage to you First, start from food Here, I have two points such as the definition of food and the classification of food The definition of food Food is any substance consumed to provide additional support for an organism. Next, for the classification of food. There are six classification of food, such as by chemical nature, by function in the body, by chemical property, by mass, by origin, and the last one by nutritive value. Let me explain to you the classification one by one. First, start from food by chemical nature. Based on the chemical nature, carbohydrate, vitamin, protein, dietary fiber, fats, and also water mineral, that is a content in included in the food. Next, the second, food by function in the body. When we consume the food, it is hoped that later the food can provide energy to the body, shape the body, and then the last one can protect us from disease. Next, food by chemical property. Here we can classification food by chemical property in two parts. That is, first one, organic food. Where the food that can be called organic food is food whose nutrient contain carbon elements. Organic nutrients such as carbohydrate, lipid, protein, and also vitamin. Next, the second in organic food, where the food that can be called in organic food is the food that do not contain carbon. Water and minerals are in organic food. Next, for food by mass. Food according to this mass will be determined from the amount of mass needed for our body. There is two types such as first one macronutrients. Macronutrients are food that are needed large amount every day, such as protein, carbohydrate, and also fat. This is the example for a food. Next, the second micronutrients. Micronutrient food that are needed in small amounts as a vitamin and also mineral. This is the picture for a food. Next, food by origin. There are also two types of food based on origin. Namely, food that come from animals and then food come from plants. And the last one, food by nutritive value. For the last, it's very important that a food that high nutrition to meet the needs of us. Nutritional food for the example such as a cereal, nuts, vegetables, fruit and tubers, fruit, milk, meat, condiment and spices. Alright everyone, that's all about food. Next, I would like to continue about a beverage. Here, I will also explain two points about beverage, such as the definition of beverage and then classification of beverage. The first one, the definition of beverage. Drinks or beverage are one of the various liquids that human can consume by drinking. And do you know, the water is not a drink. The purpose of drink is quench thirst or feel refreshed. Beverage can be cold or ice, warm or hot, steel or carbonate, alcoholic or non-alcoholic, made from natural ingredients or more actively products. Drinks can be consumed by drinking directly using a glass or drinking using a stove. 
snacks for the classification of beverage. There are two types of beverage, such as the first one, alcoholic drinks. Alcoholic beverage or drinks are portable liquids containing 2% to 75% liquor. They are produced by the introduction of yeast for fermentation into substances such as a fruit, cereal, molasses, and plant extract. Alcoholic beverage are divided into two categories, which are follows fermented alcoholic drinks and distilled alcoholic drinks. Fermented alcoholic drinks, for the example, is wine. Wine is a drink made by fermenting grapes or other fruits such as a cherry, apricot, pear, and any other one with the addition of yeast. Next example is beer. Beer is prepared by fermenting grains with yeast with the additional of hops. These are commonly called fermented milk drinks. Next, distilled alcoholic beverage. Distilled drinks, spirits, liquor, or hard liquor are alcoholic beverage produced by distilling a mixture produced by alcoholic fermentation such as wine. Drinks are distilled using pot steel or patten steel. Distilled drinks such as rum, whiskey, vodka, cream, brandy, and tequila. They are also called spirits. Spirits with flavor and sweeteners are called liquids. Next, the last one is non-alcoholic drinks. Non-alcoholic beverage refer to non-toxic drinks or soft drinks which do not have small amount of liquor by volume of yes is not added to convert sugar into alcohol during the fermentation. They are considered it a soft drink which can be had according to choose and standard. For the example, for non-alcoholic drinks such as the sparkling water, mineral water, juice, coyote, syrup, tea, coffee, milk, and any other one. Alright everyone, that's all about food and also beverage and thank you for watching and don't forget to like comment and also subscribe this video thank you so much goodbye